Cadre's transition into the co-executive leadership model very much was an intention to bring alignment, bring more alignment into Cadre's work and mission with the executive leadership. Uh, two things stick out to me the most that was really emphasized in the, um, in the interviewing and onboarding process. One of those things is that Cadre is a parent membership organization. It is centered in parents. Um, and our parents are the driving force of the organization. So that was, and that was really emphasized and really apparent throughout the interview and onboarding process. And also, our parent membership and work is centered in black and brown solidarity. And that's really important because that is not a, um, a model that you see often and regularly in the nonprofit space, particularly within education. So in that transition, my co-executive director is a Latino male, a brown male. I am a black woman. And in that way, us working together in that onboarding process really did foster that solidarity, that black and brown solidarity that is really at the core of Cadre's mission and vision. And so I saw the transition from the founder model into the co-executive director model between a black and a brown leader, very much an intentional transition uh, to bring that alignment of the organization's mission and vision and the center of our work into the leadership roles.